to my channel and guess what I decided to go to Walmart um, I got a little bit of motivated and I looked at my bonuses and I'm like I could not pass up a five dollar bonus right now it's Ibotta's fifth birthday I've had Ibotta for three and a half years now and I absolutely love it. it is my favorite app at all or of all time if you guys haven't joined click my referral link you guys get ten dollars um, when you guys join and redeem your first rebate and then you guys get to be on my team for all those asking to be on my team I am looking at a way for you guys to be on my team the only way we can be on uh, my team is if we're Facebook friends and right now I'm not letting everybody be Facebook friends with me so I am looking at another way so just give it some time and I'll figure out a new way for you guys um, but for those who haven't joined, click my link and you guys can be on my team. And I did make a video of how to use the Ibotta app in the information below. So what I needed to do is they had their, their anniversary and I needed to get 25 items for their anniversary and get 5 bucks. Well, between my Target haul yesterday and CVS and Walgreens, I ended up making it. So I got my $5 bonus, but I'm just here to tell you guys what I got. Um, I... I'm pretty excited to show you guys what I got. So the first deal I got is this Country Crock. One of you guys was telling me about it. Um, the Country Crock Butter. I got the unsalted one because this one was actually on sale for $1.98. I didn't have any coupons for it. I don't think there was any coupons out there. Oh, it expires the 28th, which is in a week, but I freeze it, so it's not a big deal. Um, so this was $1.98. You guys can submit a 75 cent rebate on Ibotta, plus you guys can submit a 75 cent rebate on either Saving Star or Checo 51. I just did Checo 51, but it's uh, Checo 51 says you can't use it with other apps, so I just did it with Checo 51. So the final price for this just comes to be 48 cents, which is an awesome awesome deal otherwise the other price is 248 if you guys wanted to get that deal um i ended up getting the french's ketchup now i just wanted to make my bonus so this is the reason why i did all this stuff because some of the stuff i still have but you know i got a lot of food items a lot of food items um this was $1.98. You guys would pay $1.98, but then you can submit a dollar rebate on Ibotta, making this just $0.98, cents, which is a great, great deal if you guys like French's ketchup. Now, I... I did the Nutella deal. Now, some people have a different deal than everybody else, but this was $3.48. I had two double whammy re rebates. I got um, I got one for two dollars and one for a dollar fifty. So these ended up becoming um, three fifty. So I ended up getting two cent money maker. So you guys, some of you guys might have the double whammy. Some of you guys might just have one or the other. So these ended up becoming a free deal for me, which I absolutely love. Um, I ended up getting the Kotex Fitness. These were $2.97. I used two $1 off coupons that we got, I think, like two weeks ago. You guys would just pay $3.94 for both of these, but then you guys can get a $2 off a two rebate from Ibotta, making the final price for these just $1.94 or $0.97 a piece. I have so, so many of these that this is a great product that I just donate. So there's that deal if you guys enjoy that. The next deal I got is these Kotex pads. Now I do have problems all the time with these not scanning at the register. I got the right product. Actually, I think it's for these, but my coupons always have problems. So they just kind of call the, the manager on duty and they're okay it. So these were $2.86. I used two $1 off coupons from a couple weeks ago. You guys would pay $3.72 for the both of these, but then you guys can submit a two off a of two rebate with Ibotta, making the final price for these um, $1.72 or just 86 cents a piece, which is a great deal. I 
also got the Click uh, You by Kotex. These were $3.84. You can use two $1 off coupons. You guys would pay $5.68 for the both of these. Again, submit two off of two on Ibotta, making the final price for these just $3.68 or $1.84. Um, I wouldn't say this is a great deal, but like I said, I really needed to get 15 more rebates to make my bonus. Um, the next deal I did was the got to be. Now, this was not the greatest deal, but I, like I said, I still wanted to get it. So this was, my camera just went, just flipped, it was weird. Um, $4.78. You guys wanna use that dollar off coupon that we got from a couple weeks ago. You guys would just pay $3.78, but you can submit a dollar rebate with Ibotta, and there's three different ones that you guys can do. Um, but then you guys would just pay $2.78 for this, which is a pretty decent deal. I ended up getting the Tums Chewy Bites. Now, there's a coupon that you guys can print off the Chewy Bites uh, website. You just go to TumsChewyBites.com or whatever. And then there's a coupon where you can print for 50 cents or if you share it, so I just shared it on my Twitter, you guys would get a $1.50 coupon. So this is $3.84. I used that $1.50 off coupon. So I ended up paying $2.34 for this. But then you can also submit a $1.50 rebate from Ibotta, making the final price for this just 84 cents, which is an awesome, awesome deal. Um, pretty excited to try these. I know I've gotten them before, but I haven't tried them yet. I ended up getting the Sagento cheese. Can't go wrong with cheese. This was $2.84. I used that $1.25 off a of two coupon. You guys would pay $4.43, but then you guys can submit two 75 cent rebates on Ibotta and two 75 cent rebates on Checkout 51, making the final price for these just $1.43 or 72 cents a piece for cheese. And if you guys haven't already, submit this to your Savings Star account I already got my money for that the other day, so that was a great deal on cheese. I ended up doing the Orbit gum because I'm handing this stuff out for Halloween. Now this was 96 cents. I used a 50 cents off a of two coupon that we got from a while ago. You guys would just pay $1.42 for the both of them, but then you can submit a 50 cent rebate for each one, making the final price for these just 42 cents or 21 cents a piece, which is a great, great deal. Um, now what I'm gonna do is I kinda uh, repeated what Jeff Saves with Coupons did. He got some food deals and I wanted just to hit, you know, some more levels. So thank you, Jeff, for giving me some of these ideas. Uh, the credit for these items go to him because you can't go wrong with cheap foods. So the first deal I got is the Mama Mary's Pizza Crust. I haven't made pizza with this in a very long time. So this was $3.48. You guys can print my screen is going weird you guys can print um a dollar off coupon off i think you guys can just go to smart source and print it off otherwise i can put the link below um you guys would end up paying two dollars and 48 cents for this but then you can submit a dollar rebate on ibotta making the final price for this just a dollar 48 now make sure you guys check the dates on your thing because i found some that were expired so i just kind of threw them somewhere but uh, make sure you guys check the dates on that. Mine doesn't expire till the middle of December, so I'll be making pizza soon. Um, 
The next thing I got is the Cort Cantani or Cantadia uh, Crush Tomatoes. These were $1.54. There's a 50 cent off coupon that you guys can print off at coupons.com. You guys would just pay a dollar four for this, but then you guys can submit a 25 cent rebate with Ibotta, making the final price for this just 79 cents. Okay, the next deal I got is the Pace Salsa. This was $1.98. You guys would pay $1.98. Now you can do different sizes. I just did the smaller one. Um, but you guys would pay $1.98, but then you guys can submit a 50 cent rebate on through Ibotta, making the final price for this just a four, $1.48. And then the last deal I got is the Celestial Tea. Now, I do not have those dollar off coupons. I've been searching for those coupons, which I don't have them. But I ended up finding a 55 cent off Peely off of these. So this was $1.98. I used that 55 cent off Peely that was on the product. I paid $1.43 for this. But then you guys can submit a dollar rebate, making the final price for this just 43 cents, which I think was a great Great deal. So definitely check out if you guys see any of those peelies. So that was my haul. Thank you, Jeff, for letting me copy you, I guess. Um, but I was pretty excited. My total came to $44.64 for everything. I ended up getting $26.50 back with Ibotta. I also got a couple like any bonuses because I bought certain products. I got $5 back for the Ibotta Versary or whatever. I got $2 back because I finished level 4. This is like the 4th or 5th month in a row that I hit level 4 which is awesome. I know a lot of you guys said you've never hit level 4 either so that's super exciting. I got $2.25 back from Checkout 51. So if you guys add all that stuff together, I got eight, everything for $8.89. How awesome is that? Um, I got 21 items and everything was just $0.42 cents a piece. So you can't go wrong with that. But if you guys enjoyed this Walmart I bought a haul, please let me know by giving it a thumbs up. If you guys find any deals that I missed, please let me know. Um, I'm pretty excited and I'm actually glad we're getting more food because I actually plan on donating a bunch of food for food pantries right now. Like it's that season where people are going to start needing that stuff. I just donated a big box of food for my neighbor. They were having a food pantry drive so I just did that. But um, yeah, I just want to let you guys know if you have any questions, comments, concerns, please let me know. And I will see you guys all next week for another Walmart I bought a haul. See you guys later. Bye bye.